You pick. You pick. Mm. Oh, look at that. <clears throat> it says roll cake. Uncle Pierre's yes. strawberry roll cake. So cute. Pierre Doji san no roll cake. Ichigo aji. Strawberry flavors. I said it's. You spoke way too fast. Pierre Doji san. Mr. Pierre's roll cake. Ichigo cream. How cute. This is also similar packaging as the um, cookie that we just had. The 80s. It looks 80s. It's cute, no? A roll Look cake with cute. delicious strawberry cream sandwich between softly baked cake dough. Look how cute. And he says delicious. <laughs> so cute. Look how cute. He's not saying delicious. He is. He no, says you delicious. Guys say, you guys delicious. Say. <laughs> the Japanese Totally miss what your description was. You don't I, have to I read think it. <laughs> because you already said it before, you don't have to repeat it for me. Oh, is it crumpled up? No, it's not. It's not what I was. <laughs> it's not what I was expecting. It's like where's the rest of yeah, it? Yeah, really. What happened? But uh, uh like it kind of looks like a. Uh, it does not sandwich. look. <laughs> it looks like a ham and cheese like sandwich, but like but smushed. Like yeah. <laughs> Here, I'll take it. I don't know. Where's the I saw, pink? I saw the picture. Where's the so pink? I was expecting it to look like that. I was it's expecting not pink. pink. It's white. I know. I'm expecting pink. Okay. <laughs> like literally, it looks like a sub. <laughs> like a right. It looks like a. Ham and cheese stuff. It's mushy Does too. It smell? Well, it yeah. smells. It smells like strawberry. Sweet. It smells good. It smells sweet. It's very mushy. It's not no regular bread. <laughs> it's not supposed to be bread. It's supposed to be roll cake. What's the difference? Oh, the cream is like creamy. Creamy. I'm not a big fan of it. Of the what consistency or everything. First of all, I'm lactose intolerant, so oh, I can't do all this cream. It's very creamy. This. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> no, I'm trying to. Like the cream is very like buttery. Yeah. Like, like a, a whipped butter. Yeah. It's not even like a thick buttery cream or of sweetness or saltiness. Like it, yeah. Very light, whipped. I don't even know. Like it feels like I'm biting into butter. I feel like <laughs> biting into nothing. Mmm. I'm sorry. The packaging was cute, but. Mm hmm. A little mm. disappointed on that one. Yeah, like just a few bites was enough. Oh, another cute packaging. Panda? Pandoro. Pandaro? Pen mel <laughs> Let's see. Pandaro. Melon pandaro. How cute. A cookie. Melon cookie. Oh. Pandaro melon cookie. Japan's oh, no, famous melon bread. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't know that. Yes. Gets a cute makeover with this panda shaped cookie. Keep the spring vibes going with the light and fruity taste of melon in a cookie that comes in a variety of cute expressions. Unfortunately, I feel that it's already broken. No, we have to see the cute expression. No, he's like broken. <gasps> oh, we can't. Let's try to take. Hold on. No, I can't. It's Bro broken. Here. Oh, no. Okay. Take, take a piece. I think we could do this. Put it together like a puzzle yeah. piece. Oh, no. Maybe not. Here, take the top. What? Take the top? Yeah, take what? the big part. Uh-oh. No, I don't... Mm. Okay. No? No. <laughs> okay. No? This is sad. No, this is sad. Uh -huh. This is sorry. Unfortunate. But it has a slight green color. It actually smells, it smells like melon. It smells very buttery, too, though. So, I don't know if you've ever, ever had melon bread. No, I didn't even know melon bread was a thing. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. This is very a, buttery. Though. It's a butter cookie. Hence, the buttery taste. Mm. 
I don't know what the melon bread tastes like, so I can't really. But it tastes like melon, or it has a scent of melon. It's like a butter cookie with the scent of melon. I feel like the buttery flavor is overpowering the melon, though. Keep chewing. <laughs> I taste the melon a lot. Or the... Mm -hmm. You smell the melon, you don't really taste the melon, if that makes sense. It's good. It actually is. I'm not a big fan of melon. Really? Yeah, I don't like this melon meaning like the honeydew melon, the yeah. green little melon. Yeah. I'm not a big fan. Why? I'm not a big fan of cantaloupe either, but why? <laughs> it's good. Why do you like it? I'll eat it if it's there, but I won't go and buy like, it. But you don't like the flavor? Mm. Like my mom loves the melona bars, mm -hmm. the ice cream. Mm -hmm. She's addicted. Mm. She could have an entire box. So good. I don't like it. It was actually good though. You want more? Okay. <laughs> it is a little buttery. <clears throat> a little. Butter, butter. It's very butter. It's a butter cookie. I'd expect a buttery. Buttery. Let's see, what is this? Mochitaro. New mochitaro. Mochi is uh, rice cake. And taro is like a, a Japanese version of the name John. <laughs> like it's like a very like common what, like taro is taro oh, not common but like kind of like a yeah like Jap if you like think of like a Japanese name. name then it's like taro yeah I didn't know that because like, all I know is when I get bubble tea they have a taro oh, flavor that's different no okay. <laughs> that's different penalty shot for me my Six. apologies <laughs> oh my goodness epic fail. April in Japan is all about new starts, and we hope new Mochi Taro will be bringing you a whole new snacking experience. These salty and crunchy rice crackers are an addictive snack with major retro vibes. What's going on over there? Well, oh, <laughs> I ripped. <laughs> that was, was a guilty laugh. <laughs> well, I was opening it, and it literally ripped in half. Oh, okay. Just a few, please. Here you go. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, she literally it, tore me it flew the out. entire like, look at the bag. Back. Look at this. All of this she poured. All of this. I thought we were just tasting it. I ripped it, like, mm -hmm. you know. Not on purpose, but Cheers. I actually... It smells salty and sweet. No? <laughs> like it smells like grease to me. Uh uh. Like oily. It smells like oil to me. It tastes a little oily. There's not really much. What is it supposed to taste like? <laughs> I don't. It says it's supposed to be salty and crunchy. I don't taste it's the salt. It's not very salty. It's just crunchy. It's very crunchy. But it has no flavor. It does. But again, it's very light. Too light. Everything else that we had is literally overbearing. Strong? Mm. Mm, I feel like Japanese snacks in general is very light, though. Except for that cheese... This cheese. <laughs> this is the only one. Should we do save these? For no. Sakura donuts. I I don't like donuts. Bowl. 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 Ba bowl. <laughs> bowl means stick. This ain't a stick. <laughs> so this is. Cherry blossom donut stick. It does not look like a stick. Let me find the description. There's One three moment, of them in here. please. Here we go. Sakura donut sticks. The delicious taste of sakura now in a donut. 
It's dipped in honey with plenty of cherry blossom syrup, creating a donut mm -hmm. bar mm -hmm. with a rough. fresh spring flavor. Oh. That's a donut stick. Bowl, 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 bowl. bowl. <laughs> I thought I was eating Hungry? the rice cracker thing. It wasn't even the rice cracker. <clears throat> it looks very like saturated. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can Extremely. Tell, but it looks very saturated. <laughs> oh, it wasn't even crunchy. No, it's a donut. <laughs> oh, but it feels like a hard donut. Mm. Kind of like the original donuts. It's hard though. Original donuts are kind of... No? What kind of donuts have you had? This has no smell. Yes, it does. <laughs> <laughs> I don't smell. What does it smell like? We need coffee beans here to cleanse your nasal so Coffee, coffee but I mean, coffee, coffee beans. beans blend, yeah. I mean, coffee beans <laughs> cleanse So when, when you go sniff... um smell perfumes and stuff oh. if you smell too much they actually give you coffee beans oh and really actually cleanses your i've never been to a bougie store <laughs> they never offered me coffee beans it's there no i never saw coffee beans i don't know where you <sighs> Jeez. no seriously what does it smell like because i churros. smell nothing it doesn't smell like churros sweet churros i think you need the coffee I... it doesn't smell it like anything like a sweet donut <laughs> Sweet. We'll taste it. it. Cheers. It's a little pink in the inside. <laughs> no cheers. Okay. Cheers, Jaina. Oh, ew. It tastes like nothing, no? It tastes cinnamon. <laughs> I hate cinnamon. Oh. Um. Yeah, I don't. Oh. A little bit of cinnamon, cinnamon. yes. I, mm -hmm. yeah. A little bit more than enough for me. Well, you don't like cinnamon, that's mm -hmm. why. You smell, smell it now. Maybe I smell different. I seriously don't smell anything. The outside is a little crunchy. It's not crunchy at all. No. <laughs> it's soggy. What are you talking about? It's just a hard donut. Sorry. How could we? How could we be so different <laughs> with the same thing? I don't smell anything. I think the outside is a little crunchy. Where's the crunch? <laughs> <laughs> she said. But it doesn't taste like. It doesn't anything. have much flavor yet. Like, it's not really sweet. No. It's not salty. I don't, I don't know. know how much flavor. It's hard to describe. I'm sorry. Cheers! <laughs> Pokey! What flavor? Cherry blossom? Probably. Pucky Heartfelt Cherry. We love spring cherry? almost as much as we love Pucky Heartfelt Cherry. The sweet and slightly sour cherry chocolate covers oh, a yeah, pretzel base cherry flavor. shaped like a heart. Oh, cute. Really? That's what it is um, advertising. I wonder how it actually is. It's cute. It's a lot. How cute is the packaging? Super cute. I'll we'll see what it looks like. Okay. Put that there somewhere. Oh, open. Oh. Oh, shoot! <laughs> it's not my fault. <laughs> there okay. you go. <coughs> no. <laughs> oh, no. I want. 
This. It's oh, hard. it's slightly it's hard. hard. You can see it from the gator. Slightly hotter, hotter. Just use your imagination. It just melted all over my hand. It smells good. So the stick itself is pink, and then the coating is like more white. white. It does smell. Oh, it smells. Yeah, it smells good. It smells cherry-ish. Yes. I think you're gonna say it doesn't smell like anything. I was like, it smells very cherry. Mm. It tastes yeah. like cherry candy. Somehow. Cherry. It tastes of cherry. It's not too sour. No. Because it says sour cherry. It's very soft. The flavor. taste, yes, the flavor. <laughs> I was like, this is crunchy. This is not soft. The flavor. <laughs> How many percent is this? <laughs> Only seven. This is not bad. Is it good? <laughs> you know what's bad? I've only had cherry flavor medicine oh like cough i never had like cherry because all the candies and sweet stuff are usually strawberry and stuff like that because cherry you never had like cherry jolly ranchers no <gasps> that's my strawberry watermelon watermelon my ultimate favorite mm. i actually avoided cherry huh really don't judge <laughs> Wait, Watermelon like and green apple. Cough medicine? Green apple. Mm. Yeah. Cherry and grape are the ones that I usually go to. For. Really? Oh, grape I avoided. <laughs> the regular. I like grape, but not grape Jolly Rancher. That would be like my last choice. Grape's not bad, actually. It's. There's cherry is my last flavor. I actually <gasps> don't have the cherry one. Mm -mm. What other candies have cherry, though? Gummy bears? That's a good question. There's a lot. I'm have to look them. I don't pick those candies though. <laughs> oh, I lied. Oh, oh! Way to go. <laughs> Starburst. What's the red flavor? Is that cherry? Yes. Oh, I picked that one. <clears throat> See? forgot about Starburst. Poor Starburst. <laughs> Poor Starburst. Oh! Don't mind me. I don't eat candy a lot. Ooh. Fanta. Ooh, 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 ooh. So it says white peach and yellow peach. Yogurt rush. Yogurt rush. Let me read the English. Version. English. English. Fanta. Fanta yogurt rush. White and yellow peach? Mm -hmm. Why you ask me? It says in English. 2021 saw the launch of the majorly popular Fanta yogurt rush, but 2022 Ooh. is kicking up a notch with a peachy twist. The mild yogurt... Oh, it smells so good! The mild yogurt blends perfectly with the refreshingly sweet white and yellow peach flavor. Who likes peach? Peach. Only bad thing. Did you shake that. it? No. No. Oh. It's carbonated. Oh, it is. It's not. It's cold. Oh, it smells so good. Though. It smells peachy. Oh my god! It smells like candy. Cheers. Mm, 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 mm. What was that? Mm hmm. Sweet. <laughs> it's like sweet peach. Mm -hmm. It's like candy yogurt. Um. I feel like it's a high chew that's melted. Mm -hmm. Legit, like a high chew peach high chew that's melted into <clears throat> this liquid seltzer form. I'm not gonna lie. The smell is not that pleasant though. When you first smell Open it, from it, here, it smells good. 
But when you pour it in here, it doesn't smell. In that glass, it's the glass. Like it kind of smells like spoiled. No, it's the glass. No, it's <laughs> the glass. Cause it doesn't smell like that here. How's it taste though? Sweet, yogurty. It's like very sweet. Peach. I can't do too sweet. Mm. Yeah, a few sips is enough. If you mix it with seltzer water, I think it yes, should be good. Yes, which we do have on the side in case. Oh, she's thirsty. <laughs> thirsty. Oh, that was refreshing. Oh, how are we going to do this? Mm. So we do have soba, the buckwheat noodle. Buckwheat! It says with the, the baby shrimps in there. Shrimp tempura soba noodle. We're breaking up all the spring of sweets with the taste of noodles with majorly unique Japanese vibes. It's a type of yummy shrimp flavor that contrasts the light yet super slurpable noodles. So I will open this and I will pour some hot water in there. Wait for three minutes, and then we'll test it out. If you want, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> let me open it and show you what it looks like. Anyone who's interested, here you go. So inside is just the noodle, and then there's the soup, and then the shrimp. What do you call it? Packet. Packet. Shrimp. Dried shrimp. Oh, there's dried shrimp. Oh, I, I guess. Like that. Yeah, yeah. Fried shrimp. We'll find out. Okay, I will go make this and we'll, we'll be right be back. back. A few moments later. Hi, we're back. We're back. So this is cooking. We have to wait like another minute or so, but it smells very shrimpy. No? Oh, it's very, very shrimpy. I mean, part. it is a shrimp. Soba. Soba. Let's figure out what kind of <laughs> Shrimp tempura soba noodle. Slurpable noodles. Do you like soba? Have you ever had soba? I like soba. Okay. But my favorite <clears throat> is udon actually me too i prefer udon over soba so it actually there's a portion in the book that says know your noodles hmm. let me read that while we wait sure let's find out there's ramen which is the classic the famous japanese noodle that actually came from china you'll usually find it hot in a variety of salty broths top salty broths and topped with veggies and pork and then you got soba light and tasty You'll notice soba is being different to the others for their brown color. That comes from the buckwheat flour that they they are made from. Soba is lighter than other types of noodles, and eating them has been connected to living a long life. Oh, really? Which is part of the reason why I actually eat them. Hmm. Udon, the big boy, they're actually the thicker noodles. Yes. Udon chewy. are pale noodles that are typically thicker than ramen. They are super chewy and slurpable. You'll find, you'll find plenty of tasty variations such as... Kitsune udon, fried tofu topping, or curry udon. Mm -hmm. I just like the classy udon. Classic udon or the shrimp tempura udon. And then there's yakisoba. Here. Oh. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> then there's yakisoba. Where's the soup? Yakisoba is a crowd favorite at Japanese summer festivals. These noodles are fried wheat noodles without soup, often topped with green onion, pork, and a sweet and savory sauce. I'm a soupy person. <laughs> what? Yeah. You're right there? Yeah. Continue. Yeah. Okay. Go cool. <laughs> So, there are the four kinds of noodles. What is your favorite? Udon is my favorite. I love ramen too. I like all noodles. Carbs. <laughs> Carbs are the best. I didn't know there was um instant soba, soba actually. Yeah. Yes, yes. 
Because I know even there's instant udon now, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. which still doesn't taste the same. <laughs> Definitely I like not the it. same. Oh, I like it. Uh, instant ramen good? I've had, but yeah. I like making it in the... That's good. Thank I'm you. Just side. Um, instant ramen I've had is still different in the pot, like making it in the pot versus... But it's the, so much easier when it's just like this, you know? You're right. <laughs> But it tastes different. Yeah, it I'm does. all about the taste. It's I'd rather good. sacrifice the few more minutes for the taste. For the taste. It's all about the taste. Chicka chicka. chicka. I gave you the shrimps, right? Yes, you did. They're like <laughs> they've they've uh, <laughs> expanded. Yeah, because of the fried uh, batter around it. Shrimp. Shrimp. Shrimp don't fly. Oh, <laughs> it smells good though. It's hmm. a lighter color than cheers. Lighter con- color than the regular soba. Yes, it is. But it actually looks like the texture. Right there. Right there. What? What's going on? Um, it tastes a little oily. No. Maybe it's the fried stuff that's in the mix in the mixing. <coughs> You're right there. Technical difficulties. No, I started laughing because. It probably has not been three minutes. <laughs> right? The noodles are so hard. So I don't know what instant soba is supposed to taste like. But I know the soba noodles that I have like cooked is usually a little chewy like this. So oh, okay. I don't know. I'm a bad, bad critic right now. Yeah, I don't think. <laughs> Should we wait longer? She's not even eating the noodles anymore. No, I put. She's like, you can eat the noodles, Gina. <laughs> I think actually, yes, yes. Soba noodles in general, I think, are a little bit harder compared to like udon or mm-hmm. ramen or yakisoba. But because I also don't really regularly eat soba, mm. so maybe that's why. But I just felt. Like it probably has not been three minutes. Is I don't like the dried be? shrimp, though. No? Mm-mm. Why? It doesn't taste like shrimp. It tastes like... Like a dried fish. No, but they're like the little baby... Yeah. Yeah, I can't. I'm not a big fan. Oh. Mm. I like the broth, though. The noodles, maybe it needs to be a little... Come <laughs> on. I can see what you mean. As I continually eat this not fully cooked soba. <laughs> it's good. I like it. But the broth is good for mm. sure. But you say it feels oily? Initially it was. It's not. It's not a... Um, I think it's because of the fried stuff that mm-hmm. that's in here. Mm-hmm. So... The shrimp that they have in here, it's covered with like a, a batter. batter, but it has like oils in it. Mm-hmm. Um, which, I mean, when you go to a restaurant and you have like udon or even any type of soba and you have like anything fried, that oils are going to permeate into the broth. So it's inevitable. But I wasn't expecting this from an instant. <laughs> Anyway, I mean, again, if it's more cooked, <laughs> I think it's kind of hard to mess up ramen or so why? Oh, not fully I meant the flavor. <laughs> I like it. And I like the little shrimps. Yummy. 
I'm not a big fan of the noodles. I think it's because I'm used to like the real softer. Yeah. But I definitely like the broth. I think it's good. Slightly salty. Mm -hmm. which is Maybe what, I didn't put in the water. No, but all of the, literally I'm pretty sure all of the instant noodles have, they're more salty than. Yeah, that's true. The it's not good for you, so you shouldn't eat it that often, actually. I do like the pot, though. It's, mm, good. it's good. <laughs> what was your favorite? Hmm. Mm. Favorite. I should like... Just pick one. The first favorite. one. Just one. Oh, yeah? This was yeah. the first one, though. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> sorry. My apologies. This oh, that one, one? That's your favorite. Yeah. Oh, wow. Top. Oh, this one it sorry, wait, not not this one. Wait, what's it this one? That was the donut No, stick. definitely not that one. I think it was this one. Oh, that was like the Madeline. The rice cake? What? No. Which one was the rice cake one? Rice cake? The little square ones? Yeah. No, not that. that not the square one. That was the mochi one. There was I'm pretty sure this was mm -hmm. the crispy crunchy one. This is a donut. Yeah, this is not no, That's this a is donut. donut too. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's this one. Let me just check. That's the metal. <laughs> one moment please. Why don't you well, name looking, yeah. Mine is the soba. Oh really? Yeah. The one you undercooked? <laughs> we don't know if I undercooked it. <laughs> the bunny. Yeah. The bunny. She, bunny? The sleeping bunny. Oh no. Oh, really? Yeah, the sleeping really? bunny. That was your favorite. We eat it all, that's why. <laughs> oh yeah. This one? This. Oh no, this. Oh, there's two. Yeah, yeah. No, no, you put <laughs> Try to stack all the things. This these one. are my two favorite. I can't pick between these two. Oh, really? But these oh, are my favorite. My savory one. What about you? Just this so yeah, one? this one's my favorite. Yep. What about the sweets? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe this one. Mm. What was that? <laughs> this one was good too. Like the it was, cat. but it's too sweet. Yeah. I don't like too sweet. So I like this one. I, I feel like I keep, keep keep on eating this one. Mm. My least favorite was that cheese. The cheese. Oh yeah. Cracker that. Ugh. This was another. No, yeah, I know like the this, this strawberry roll, fake fake strawberry roll. Mm -mm. I just want to finish eating the noodles. Let's let her finish. <laughs> Till next time. Thank you for hanging, Thank out, you with for us. hanging out with us. Bye, Bye guys.